Maybe you should pull the fucking trigger. Pull the trigger. Ain't nobody gonna do for you. Hey guys, what is up? It is Dakota here, and today I'm going to be bringing you some good PS4 modding information. Um, my good friend RedEyeX32 has created a PSN update bypasser, so you can basically get on PlayStation Network on later updates of PS firmware. This is for PlayStation 4, and as you can see right now, I am on 3.50. I will actually show you here pretty soon. Let me switch over to my PS4. Now let's go to settings, go to system, all the way at the bottom and system information there you can see I'm on 3.50 um, I can't uh, exactly confirm that this is up to date so you're gonna have to take my word for it but yeah so things you're going to need is that you're going to need this uh, program called PS Proxy Red made this and it actually works very well so we're gonna go ahead and run this and here uh, I'll give you a little tutorial this is the IP that you're going to be inputting the port you're going to be inputting Make sure PS4 mode and bypass update are clicked. This is where you're going to put the current version of whatever firmware you're trying to bypass. So current firmware is 3.55 and then here you're just going to select your region. So you're going to go ahead and click start. Uh, allow access to change uh, network stuff. Let me switch back over to my PS3 or my PS4. Hopefully that moved the program out of the way. Uh, now we're going to go to settings, network. Uh, not test internet connection. Set up internet connection, Wi-Fi. You're basically just going to set up this internet basically how you would any other way. Uh, but except when you get to the end this time, you're going to change it to the, um, the, the proxy that you had selected. So here I have uh, 192.168.1.1. One two nine, which is the same as the one on the program. Go ahead and click next. Uh, you don't need to test internet connections. Now you're going to go to PlayStation Network account management. Go ahead and hit sign in. Go ahead and click update later, and then sign in. And as you can see, now I am online on version. 3.50 right there so if you guys enjoyed be sure to like the video comment down below subscribe for more information i'll see you guys later peace